Can you die from a broken heart? Yeah, no, th th this is interesting. You'd think, oh, what a load of rubbish. But you hear it so many yeah. times. Exactly. Yeah. Couples yeah. have been together forever. One goes and the other one goes soon after. Yeah, there have been a few stories this year mm. like that. And, and basically, it's the emotional impact, certainly, of losing a, a loved one. Um, can damage the heart short term and long term short term you're under stress the stress hormones are you know pouring out and they can cause very irregular heartbeats or very rapid pumping of the heart uh, and that can lead to heart failure but there's also a long-term effect that uh, because of that sort of um, rapid pumping of the heart some of the the muscle fibers in the heart die and they're replaced by scar tissue yeah. so in the long term the heart doesn't pump efficiently as, as it should do mm. so there's a long-term effect as well it's actually got a, a medical term it's called takotsubu cardiomyopathy takotsubu japanese uh, it's an octopus pot that they catch octopuses pie in. I'm trying to uh, see the link here. No, it's the shape. The, yeah. shape of, the shape of this fishing pot is very similar to the shape of the heart oh, when right. it's undergoing this condition. Oh, OK. <laughs> All right. So it is possible. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Well, well yeah, it's interesting that in, in the case is affected 90% are women. Mm. Now, why? Mm. Well, because men die before the women and the women are left suffering the emotional yeah. stress of losing yeah. their loved one. Oh, yeah. it's really sad. Yeah.